Dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace is one of the newest and most trending marketplaces to sell on and there is one good reason why that is and that is because it simply works. I will show you my Facebook marketplace dropshipping account in this video and we're going to talk about the top 9 reasons why dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace works. So if you had any interest in taking over this selling channel, this is the right video for you. Quick intro and let's go. What's up everybody, hope you're all having a great day today. My name is Luan from AutoDS, I'm the content manager and I've also been dropshipping for the last several years. And in this video, I want to hype you guys up about the Facebook Marketplace. I'll also show you my Facebook Marketplace dropshipping account. I won't hide anything so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing. There's also a live Facebook Marketplace case study, which I will add soon to our YouTube channel, showing you step by step everything that I did in that account. But that is not what we're here to talk about. Here, we're going to talk about the top nine reasons why dropshipping on the Facebook Marketplace works. And this is really good information for you guys, for anyone who is interested in getting started. Let's go ahead and see what the big fuss is about and what you can do about it to really make some great profits at the end of the day. So why does it actually work? Let's start with reason number one. Reason number one is that it is a new untapped marketplace and this should go without saying but if you're still new here, if this is the first time you heard about it or you just started hearing about it recently, it is still very very new, it is still very very untapped at this moment while I'm recording this video in the month of August 2021. So we started talking about the Facebook marketplace a couple of months back. Anyone who jumped in during that time and even now after watching this video, it's definitely not too late. This is a very new marketplace for dropshippers. Anyone once again who's jumping on this wagon right now is really reaping those benefits and rewards. So hopefully you will too after watching this video. The main point is it is a new untapped marketplace. Not many dropshippers are there. Not many competitors are there. So you can simply go to one of your supported suppliers websites, add products from your suppliers to the Facebook marketplace and start selling them. Simply search for best sellers on your suppliers websites that is good enough for now you don't need to chase after any competition and you don't need to copy any other seller whatever he's doing or whatever he's selling none of that is needed right now at the facebook marketplace completely untapped profits are yours to be had reason number two why dropshipping on the facebook marketplace works is that there are simply almost 3 billion users worldwide. Now, that is a whole lot of people to see your listings. Now, this doesn't mean that over 2 billion people are going to see your listings, but when you start dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace, all of the 50 states in the US will be able to see your listing. So that is a whole lot of traffic and that is a whole lot of sales. So Facebook has a huge amount of users worldwide and those residing in the US will be able to see your listings. Now we know that the US is one of the biggest markets in the world. So this is the market that we want to target and we simply have so many people there. So it is really an easy place to sell on. So many users worldwide to see your listings, especially in the US, which is where we are targeting. Reason number three, increased sales through Facebook groups. And now I will show you the example from my Facebook Marketplace dropshipping account. When you're dropshipping on the Facebook Marketplace, like I said, you're going to target the US audience when you have shipping options, we'll talk about that in a minute. And then you'll be able to sell to anyone living in the US. You'll be able to ship to 50 states. And then anyone in those 50 states will be able to see your listing and buy. So that is one way to get traffic to your Facebook Marketplace store. Facebook simply gives you organic traffic. So this organic traffic is worth a lot. And we're going to put that on the side for a second. Another way to get more organic traffic to our listings, if the first method isn't enough, and it is, we can do it through Facebook groups. So when we post a listing on the Facebook marketplace, we can share that listing in Facebook groups and that way we'll get more people to see our listing, more traffic, which of course converts to more sales. So let me show you my Facebook marketplace dropshipping account and what I mean by increased sales through Facebook groups. By the way, everything that I'm talking about is written in the blog. I will leave a link to it right below this video. So click there if you want to read the blog and learn more about the Facebook marketplace. So as you see here, I'm in the marketplace. Now on the left side, I'm going to click on your account. And as you can see, here are my Facebook marketplace listings. So these are all the listings that I got from suppliers such as Amazon and Banggood. Once again, on my live case study, I'm going to go over everything that I did on this account from day one. So stay tuned for the Facebook marketplace live case study. What I'm going to do now is click on shipping orders so you can see some of the products that I'm selling and what we can do with it. So here is one product that I'm selling and it's 
it's actually being sold. As you can see, this one sold three times in a row. So let's click on this product. As you see, I put shipping information, so it's out for delivery right now, but let's put that once again on the side. Let's say that I saw that this item is selling well, or I just added it to my store and I want to increase the traffic to this product and not just rely on the organic traffic that Facebook offers us. So I'm going to click on this product to go inside the listing. And as you see here, I have a share button. If I click on this button, you can see that I have an option to list in more places. I'm going to click on that and as you see now Facebook is giving me the opportunity to post this item to share this item in more groups. So what you want to do first is join groups that are relevant to the products that you are adding and then share those products in those specific groups. That is one great way to bring traffic to your store and I'm sure that it's helping me with my sales. Now you don't have to do it from the order screen you can also do it from the listings that you have on your store. So on the left side, we're going to click on your account and now we're in your listings by default. So you can see the products here. You can simply click on the three dots right here and list the product in more places. Now, of course, when you're importing the products, you'll also have the option there to list them in more groups. So there is a few ways to get to it. And that is how you get about to adding your products to more groups and getting more traffic and more sales that way. So reason number three why dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace works is that you can simply get more sales through Facebook's groups. Reason number four why dropshipping works on the Facebook marketplace is that there are no startup costs. And this is the dream for every business owner that wants to start a new business. Nobody wants to pay a lot of money upfront, any type of huge investment when you're starting a new business. And there are a few reasons for that. One, you may not have that type of capital in the beginning of your journey. And two, you simply don't want to put so much money into something where you don't know for sure if it'll work. Now, of course, this is a risk that we have to take in life. But in this case, we don't have to take that risk because there are no startup costs. All you have to do is go into your Facebook Marketplace account, click on Create New Listing, and import your first listing to the Facebook Marketplace. And only once you get paid for an item, Facebook will only then subtract a 5% transaction fee from the price of the product that you listed on the Facebook marketplace. And besides that, the rest of the profit is yours to be had. So you have the supplier's price. When you get an order on the Facebook marketplace, you're going to log into your supplier's site, pay your supplier for that product and ship it directly to the customer. So you have the source price minus the 5% transaction fee that Facebook takes. The rest of the profit is yours. So no startup costs, no initial investment. Great reason to start a new business with so much organic traffic. So you don't actually have to pay any traffic source to bring traffic to your website. So no initial investment required and no need to pay any traffic sources to bring traffic to your site. People will start coming in automatically as long as your product is interesting. Number five, why the Facebook marketplace dropshipping works is because you have shipping options. Now I mentioned this a couple of minutes ago, but let's stress this one out a little bit more. If you wanna have shipping options, and when I say shipping options, I mean that you can list a product and then be able to ship it to all of the 50 states in the United States. So as long as you can ship to any one of those 50 states, they will all be able to see your listing. If you wanna have the shipping options, and this is the biggest condition to be able to drop ship correctly today on the Facebook marketplace, if you want to be able to see the shipping options, you have to be located in the United States. If you're not located in the United States and you're trying to import a new listing to the Facebook marketplace account, you won't have shipping options. You'll only have a delivery, but only people living in that certain area will be able to see your listing. So it won't be spread out to 50 states. You won't get much traffic and you won't get much sales on your Facebook marketplace drop shipping account. Let me show you the example of what I mean by shipping options. So if I go inside any one of these listings, just to go inside the item editor. So I'm going to click on edit listing. Once again, guys, if you want the step-by-step everything that I did on this account from day one, every product that I'm selling, how much I'm profiting, where I'm getting it from and so forth. Watch out, keep your eyes open for the Facebook Marketplace live case study, which will be added soon to our YouTube channel. So here is the item editor. There's the title, the price per item category and so forth. We're going to click on next and make it to the next section. In this next section, you see that I have a delivery method. So here I'm enabling shipping and local pickup. You can have shipping only, but this is what I'm talking about. You want to have these shipping options. If you don't have them, you probably don't reside in the United States and Facebook can see that. So you have to be located once again in the US and you also have to be a US citizen. The reason for that is once you pass $600 in sales, Facebook will ask for a SSN or social security number verification to make sure that you are an American citizen. 
and only after you submit that verification information only then will they start to release the future funds that you will get from your future orders so let me show you what i mean here, if I click on your sales, you can see that Facebook sent me this message. Add tax info to resume payments. Because your sales for Marketplace checkout reach $599 this calendar year, we need to verify your tax information to comply with applicable laws and regulations and so forth. So you want to add tax information, which is the SSN verification. And this is another thing that you need to do along the way. So keep that in mind right before you start dropshipping on the Facebook Marketplace. But the shipping options, once you get it, of course, this is one of the best reasons to dropship on the Facebook Marketplace because you can simply list your listings to 50 states and they will all be able to see your listing what i said a few times in this video this is one of the most important parts if you don't have the shipping options you will not be able to drop ship on the facebook marketplace at this time now if you are an american citizen and you do reside in the united states and you don't have shipping options first try listing a product a local product from your house as if you really want to sell it Wait a couple days and see if Facebook opened up the shipping options. If they don't, simply leave them a message and they'll be able to open that option for you. But it should be as a default when you have your Facebook Marketplace US account. Reason number six for why dropshipping on the Facebook Marketplace works is because you have low fees. Now, we talked about it in the low startup costs, and this is another one of those reasons why you would really want to start on this marketplace. eBay, for example, takes around 13-14%. Other marketplaces take more or less, but at the end of the day, I haven't seen any selling channel that takes only 5% from your transaction. Like I said, eBay takes more, Shopify takes more, other selling channels that I tried take more. 5% is really, really low. And if 5% comes out less than 40 cents, then Facebook will take 40 cents as a minimum. So keeping that in mind, there's a lot of profit that we can make here. Reason number seven for why dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace works is because you can provide much better customer support to your buyers. And what I mean by this is when someone is buying from you and you're selling on eBay or Shopify, they have to reach out to you to your email or to your eBay username, depends on where you're selling, or they can simply open a case, whether it's through your payment method on PayPal, through Visa or through the credit card company, which makes it much harder for us to fight against that case. Or on eBay, they can simply open a case through eBay's platform. And then we have to start communicating with our buyers and try to resolve whatever problem they are having with their transaction. At the end of the day, people are simply going to send you messages on Facebook. Let me show you what I mean once again through our Facebook Marketplace dropshipping account. So as you see here, I have a whole lot of messages on my messenger. And this is all from customers. I don't have any friends on this account. This account is strictly for dropshipping. And as you can see, I have a lot of people sending me messages on this account. And that is because that is how they know that they will get customer support. And it's really simple this way. And it's also much better. So on the one hand, when someone wants to reach out to you, they'll simply send you a message, a direct message on the Facebook marketplace. They know that there is an actual human being interacting on the other side. So they will be more polite. They will be more understanding and they won't act like it's some big company that doesn't even care about them, which will make them more impatient want to get their money back and they won't care about anything else. So you can provide much better customer support on the Facebook marketplace. And this is one of the biggest advantages that we have here. Reason number eight for why dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace works is because you can work with multiple dropshipping suppliers. You are not limited to anything as long as you know what products you can sell and what products you cannot sell. And if you want to know about what you can and cannot sell, simply go over Facebook's commerce policies. We have the link right here. Facebook's commerce policies in the blog under section number eight. So click on that, see what products Facebook does not want to see, like all types of health products before and after making assumptions on, on your health condition or, or what the product or what you will look like or how your stomach, how skin you'll be after taking the product or any of those before and afters some types of electronics, liquids, no tobacco, firearms, things like that, of course. So read Facebook's commerce policies, see what you cannot sell, and then you'll have a huge idea of what you can sell, which is everything else. So on the, and then you'll have a great idea of all of the products that you can sell, which is a lot. And when you, and when working with AutoDS, you have access to over 25 dropshipping suppliers, opening up access to tens and millions of products. And once again, when you use any one of AutoDS's 25 plus supported suppliers, you'll get price automation, stock automation, and easy product importing to your stores. I will not demonstrate it in this video because we're only talking about the reasons why you want to join the Facebook marketplace and start dropshipping there. But just so you know, over 25 suppliers, each one of them, AutoDS, will automate your stock and your prices. So if the price changes on your supplier side, if the stock changes on your supplier side, 
AutoDS will automatically update it on the AutoDS platform and on your Facebook Marketplace account. So you don't need to do anything and your store will be automated. This will help you scale your store much faster and to really high numbers. Another reason why you want to work with multiple dropshipping suppliers is simply because you'll have a reach to much, much more products. So if one supplier is missing something that you want to add, you can easily find it on the next supplier and so forth. So with AutoDS, you're going to get price automation, stock automation, and you're going to import your products really, really easily from your supplier to AutoDS and from AutoDS to the Facebook Marketplace in only a matter of a couple of minutes instead of wasting hours and hours and hours just importing the products to your stores, which will limit you from scaling at the end of the day. So working with multiple dropshipping suppliers is one of the biggest advantages, especially when you add automation for why you want to start dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace. Reason number nine, and I talked about it in reason number eight. So let's talk about it just a little bit more. Why you want to start dropshipping on the Facebook marketplace is because of the automation. So today you can automate your stock and your prices. Once again, if anything changes on your supplier side, AutoDS will make those changes on your Facebook marketplace dropshipping account, and you can import your product really really easily we have enough videos out there on how you can import products from any one of your suppliers to the facebook marketplace and more videos on the facebook marketplace so i really hope that you guys enjoyed this video i highly encourage you guys to read the blog below this link there you have a link to more blogs like how to drop ship on the facebook marketplace a full step-by-step -step guide when you start your first account the requirements to dropship on the Facebook marketplace, which I mentioned some of those requirements in this video, your social security number and being located in the United States. You have also a live interview that I conducted with a successful Facebook marketplace dropshipper named Patrick. And we have much more related content related to Facebook marketplace dropshipping. So I hope that this video was informational for you guys. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and I will personally answer them. If you like this video, give us a little like so we will see that you guys appreciate the value that we are passing on to you. Share this video so that your friends and family can also learn about the wild and amazing world of dropshipping. And that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't done so yet. This is the type of content that we deliver and so much more. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the future videos.